Hey, welcome to Quarantine Cook-Off with your boy, Ricky Smiley. I'm so excited to have y'all. Thank y'all for joining me. I know a lot of y'all uh, are bored. You don't have nothing else to do. You stuck in the house. You working from home. And uh, so I'm like, let's cook some food, right? So, what, what, I mean, there's nothing else to do. I mean, you, you have to wear a mask everywhere you go. So you might as well just cook some food and have a good time. But today on the show, we're going to be frying some chicken. That's right, y'all. We front like yes, yeah, right. And I got my special guest. Y'all give it up and show your love for my good friend. I uh, got a new project coming out. We're gonna talk about that a little bit later. Y'all give it up for Tamar Braxton. I'm so excited to be. I'm nerve skyed. I'm so nervous and I'm excited. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Face off. I've been watching you and like. I like to think that I'm a really good cook and I'm, you know, really super competitive and I, I'm just nervous. Well, I, re I already know you can cook because your mom could cook because your mother and I, we have arguments all the time about cooking food. And then, you know, I was talking to Tony the other day. So we get into it all the time about, about cooking and who play the piano best, like church piano, yes. the best. <laughs> I, I can't sing, but I can play. <laughs> Definitely in your bag about about you inviting me first before her. So before this is right. over, you're gonna have to invite her so she can have a cook off with you. I'm just oh, asking. absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. So so we're gonna fry some chicken. So you know we kind of we kind of like having this little cook off because everybody you know Friday chicken different ways. So but when when it comes to chicken, nobody fried chicken better than the cube, right? So I think if I fry is chicken and beer. Right, so whenever you come to anything with Omega South Five, you're gonna see some chicken frying, and you can, and it's gonna be some beer. So shout out to all the bros, we're gonna get this chicken. But we don't cook this chicken on campus at our event. This is the Ricky Smiley in the house uh, chicken. But being around bros, you know, when you're a Neo, you have to fry chicken all the time. So that is what it is. So are you ready? I'm ready, and let me tell you, y'all can fry some chicken, y'all cues. That's because y'all never met the teas. Okay, all right. <laughs> So let's go. Let's go. <laughs> let's go. All right, all right. You, you going? You going first? I'm going to make hot chicken thighs, right? What? And hot, <laughs> hot chicken thighs, Michelle. Now, I am not trying to eat bread right now, so I love okay. it. anything like Italian. So this is like my take on like bruschetta without the bread. So I'm gonna use the chicken instead of the bread. Okay. All right. Okay. So what you got over there? Well, let me tell you what I got. So what I do is I soak my chicken overnight uh -huh. in buttermilk, hot sauce, one egg. I'm talking about buttermilk, like old school buttermilk. A bottle of hot sauce. You can do like almost the whole bottle in there with the buttermilk. Drop you one or two eggs, take your blender and blend it up, put the chicken in there and let it soak overnight. Ricky, you making white people try chicken, ain't it? You know white people try this, this is the closest thing to listen, this is the closest thing to churches you're gonna get. Right? Churches be selling chicken be looking like baby arms, you know what I'm saying? This is big pieces of crunchy chicken. You do kind of know what you're doing because I too have soaked mine in butter milk. Okay, and I didn't use hot sauce. I used a cayenne pepper. Oh, so, yeah, salt and pepper, garlic, <laughs> salt, garlic salt. Um, what was that? What was that? What was that popping noise again? <laughs> <laughs> yes. And so I, these are like I, I took the bone out, so there's no bone. So it's like thighs, like thigh fillets. Eat right through it. Like, mm, okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. For about, about maybe six, seven hours. Okay. That's good. That's good. So what I got is I have, uh, of course, I have, uh, I have a little bit of dill weed, just a little bit of dill weed, right? And then I got my little hot peppers, my little little hot peppers, so you can get a little little, little close up, my little hot 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 peppers, and a little bit of garlic salt. A little bit of Tony's, a little bit of, uh, uh, oh man, yeah, Tony's, a little bit of accent to wake the flavor up, and also some paprika. How about that? And um, some, uh, what else I put in there? A little bit of poultry, a little bit of onion powder, garlic powder, 
and a little bit of uh, oregano. Okay. Just, yeah, so I, I put all of that like in the flour in this big old bucket right here in the chicken and put all that in there and So you got your boom. chicken. I'm gonna use these Ziploc bags. Let me tell you why. Because this corn why? and all I've been doing, this is what day, what, 577? All yes. I've been doing is washing right. and I can't do it no more. I can't, I can't, I gotta keep it down because I can't, you know, I am, uh, you ever heard that book, heard that book, Amelia Bedelia? That's yes. That okay. Okay. All right. right. I'm gonna use this. I'm, I'm, Praise here. Team no dishes. I see you. I see you over there. But what I did, I put in a little flour. You better turn your fan on because you know you're about to burn something up. You wish. <laughs> Listen, that one is probably neck and neck with you. Okay. <laughs> look at that. Look at that. Ooh. Man, look at this, y'all. We gonna put it in the y'all. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, so let me ask you a question. Do you yeah. open your chicken when you put it in the buttermilk? Do I open it? Over season your chicken when you put it in the buttermilk. Uh I I'll do a little bit of uh lorries on there, just sprinkle it on there. Yeah, and just put it in the buttermilk. Sometimes it comes out, sometimes it don't hell. Who knows? Yeah, look at <laughs> <laughs> I don't need Daisy to come on here. Look at that. Look at that, y'all. Look at that. Woo! Woo! And look, if, if you don't shop at the restaurant supply store like I do, get your old chitlin bucket. It's an old chitlin bucket right here. So after you, uh, you know, black folks, we don't throw chitlin buckets away. See, I don't know nothing about chitlin. See, that's, that's old school. Sweet chitlins, Ricky? Your mama ain't never cooked no chitlins for y'all. Oh, I got clean chitlins in my freezer right now yes. you clean your children you clean your own children uh yes i did when they clean i can cook them i can't clean them you know <laughs> what do you do for the smell you put an onion in your children well when they clean properly they got that smell. Uh, <laughs> 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 okay don't do shake 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 hey 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 chicken twerk Boy, all right here, boy. These, woo, -woo. Boy, my okay, wings about to be looking like some baby fists. My my chicken is not gonna take a long time, so I'm gonna start on on my bruschetta part. Is that all right? Okay. Okay. I'm gonna drop my chicken. It's gonna look like Popeyes in about three point four seconds. What? <laughs> it is. Everybody be claiming Popeyes. I don't know. I don't know, Tamar. I don't know. You know, you got right. to. You gotta get it and you gotta have enough red stuff, either it's cayenne pepper or okay. That cayenne pepper, that's gonna have a little kick to it, right? Yeah, you know, uh, my boyfriend is a, um African, so we eat a lot of spicy stuff over here. Praise him. What? But he don't I eat mean, it. <laughs> so he won't be having it. What? So you already driving in the grease? I drive mine in the grease. You late. You're taking Well, let's go. Minutes. Come on, let's go. Hey, go ahead. So this All is right. sauce, y'all. Cream cheese. I just put a little butter in there. Cream cheese. Yeah, this is my sauce. Mm-hmm. And I'm gonna put <laughs> heavy whipping cream enough to cover the bottom. You know we don't measure up. Wait, a minute, I need to watch. I need to see what you're doing. You said cream cheese. Oh yeah, this is bruschetta, bruschetta. And then okay. For her in there. Oh snap. You know what I'm saying? She ain't just a pretty face. I used to have a cute waist, not no more. <laughs> hey, keep keep living. Well, I, and that's how we like it in the South. You know, we like it thick like that. It's real thick. You know, it's too thick. Yes, sir. I'm going to go ahead and start. Poor people. So I'm using um, Prima Donna. Now I call it, it's not, I call it the Beyonce season because it's popping. I'm telling you, you got everything in this. You ain't got to have a And what is that? This is, um, you know Prima Donna, she's on Love and Hip Hop, but she do the waist trainer. Right. She, yeah, she's got a little line, and I'm telling you, she sent it to me one time, and I've been ordering ever since. It's amazing. Okay. Yeah. I'm trying to make sure my grease is not too hot. Mm -hmm. Right. I have it. I have it on Lola. I don't. I, I don't like folding my wings up. I leave mine just kind of wide open, you know. 
Can y'all see that? Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all. Now, because we're using this hot pepper stuff, it's going to get brown faster. So once you turn it, right, you want to turn her down. Boom. Or she ain't going to be done in the middle. We don't have time for that. Okay. Woo! Woo! Hey, hey, hey. Oh, you just want to make some chicken and some hot sauce? You got some sides you're doing, Ricky? Oh, I got some sides. I got a surprise sides. I'm not even, I'm, you're just going to see the finished result. Okay. But, I, but what's your side? All right, tell me your size. I'll tell you my side. Well, my side is, you know, the, it's hot chicken with creamy mozzarella sauce, creamy truffle mozzarella sauce. I'm about to add this truffle right now. Uh, and, um, Tomatoes and arugula with lemon vinaigrette. Oh, snap. See, that's that LA thing right there. That's 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 <laughs> that's, that's, that's California. Now you got Atlanta roots. You know, I know you know better than that, Jay I can't fit nothing, Ricky. I gotta fit in my clothes. So I got <laughs> you should have caught me two weeks ago when it was nothing but foolishness. It was chips, it was dip. I mean, just right. I believe I was dipping my sandwiches, really honestly. And mayonnaise and and spinach dip like it was it was dumb. I was acting dumb. I had no right. no rules. I was eating pain of ice cream about every night. Like right. Like well, I I tell you what, man. This see, I got the old school cast iron skillet right here. Yeah. It's something. The the skillet is seasoned. Like right? I put that grease in there, put some salt in there. You know, my man Kurt Boudreaux taught me that how to really season your cast iron skillet. And if I'm not mistaken, I think that's the cast iron skillet that my grandmother uh, gave to me when I got my first apartment. I said, I have it. So my my grandmother used to fry, fry chicken. As a matter of fact, I'm going to show you something, Trayvon. Let me find something. Let me show you something. I can't find it. My favorite plate is missing. Oh, here it is. Trayvon. Yes. When I was five years old, all the way up to I was 10, 11, 12 years old, this is my favorite plate to eat out of when I was a kid, and I still had it. Really? I put that on everything. Uh, this is just my favorite plate. So whenever my grandmother would make chicken and rice, I always ate my chicken and rice in this plate right here. And so when I got my first apartment, I went to my grandma's house and I got that plate. And here I am, 51 years old. I still got my plate, oh. and I still I still eat out of it. This I love, and my favorite dish in this plate is chicken and and rice with butter, salt, and pepper. So I had, yeah. Back in the day when you did real breakfast, all rice and chicken with gravy and onions and yes. man, big breakfast. You know, my mother, you know, my mother didn't give us rice. We, we got grits. Oh, I mean, we did grits too, but when we did grits, grandma did like smoked sausage or bacon or mm. whatever. But sometimes, man, my grandma would do that, those pork chops and make that gravy and the big, the, remember the Hungry Jack business back in the day with the layer yeah, and the I'm commercial come on? Hungry, Hungry Jack, gobble them down in the plate, come back for a Hungry Jack. Why did you <laughs> put the pork chops in my spirit like that? Like, I wasn't even thinking about no pork chops. Yeah, now you're going to have to cook some. You can cook some and, and take like two bites and spit it out. This way you can taste it. I'm not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> we eat all that. Right. Ricky, okay, so I'm gonna work on my um my tomato bruschetta part. Okay, I'm just gonna slice. Your what? Tomatoes up like that, like so. We getting down over here. All right, I'm turning. I'm turning. Turning up. Turning. We are turning. turning. We are not playing over here. We are not playing over here. Sweet home Alabama, roll tide road. Ricky, how is Alabama doing quarantine? Are the people in Alabama, have you been outside? Are you going to the grocery stores yourself? Or are you sending your kids to the grocery store? No, no, I go to the grocery store. Uh, Alabama's doing, you know, uh, good as can be. We have like little small hot spots, but uh, I know how to social distance. So I got my mask, mm -hmm. my gloves, just careful. We've been in the house a month and a half, like, you know, like the weekend con. It, we don't, we don't say Monday, Tuesday. Wednesday, Thursday. We say uh, today, the other day, the next day. We we don't we don't say. 
None of that stuff. Oh boy, these wings about to be fine. Hold on. You making chicken wings? Ooh, praise God. Man, yeah. You know what black man? Come on, bro. Man, you know what black? You know what we like? Wings and not even wing wang. Let me tell you about this. This is Khaleesi's. I, I've been, have you been ordering online during quarantine? I have boxes coming. Amazon is Santa Claus. Yes, yes it is. This is Khaleesi. Khaleesi have olive oil? I didn't know. Oh, it's really? Delicious. What? Yes. So I like to support all my girls out here. You know what I mean? Out here doing the thing. She got her own olive oil. Her own olive oil. She got a cooking show. Now I don't know her like that, so I ain't plugging nobody. I'm just saying. Right. I'm gonna order some yeah. stuff online and it changed my life. It's amazing. Okay. Man, the chicken. Listen, huh? this chicken is so crunchy, but when you eat my chicken, this tip right here have to be in. You know, this comedian <laughs> Big Sean said this tip right here come out when you're 30. Something right there. <laughs> <laughs> Comedian, comedian Sean Lockett said, "Everybody in their thirties, that thing right there, right there." <laughs> oh, <laughs> this chicken. Right now, I'm putting my little salt and pepper on my arugula salad. I put a little salt and pepper on my tomato salad right here. I'm a, you know, I'm ready to play. You and salt and pepper push it good. All right, man. Yeah, oh, and I got my little basil. Here. I'm gonna get my <laughs> And then, and then, that salt and pepper here. Ooh, baby, baby. Oh, pepper, pepper. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Oh, uh, you, know, you, you know, you know, know that was a real dance when we was in college. Push it good. I want. I like. I like crunchy, crunchy, crunchy. Yeah, hey, Tamar, hey, tell everybody about your project. Oh well, um, I have a record out. It's called. Uh, what's the record called? No, I forgot the record. Can you come on the Ricky Smiley Morning Show and promote it? Huh? You can come on my morning show and promote it. I got eight million listeners. Oh, I would love to come on as soon as you invite me. You know, I guess you got to have the Queen Tony Braxton come first. I ain't in my feelings about that. Oh, please, please. I just, listen, I talked I talk to your sister on the phone and we have never met. I hang with you and your sister and your mom all the time. Don't never play. met Tony Braxton? Never in my life. Well, Ricky, how we many talk, people in the chicken do you have that? Let me tell you a funny story. How many we people? talk on the phone, we FaceTime, but we have never met. She's one of my closest friends that I never met. Look at it, look. Oh, hey, Ma. Like what? What a little piece right where 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 that light skin right there? You have to put that back in there. No, ain't nothing wrong with that. Well, wait a minute. Let me can I can I show you the finished finished product? Tamar. Yes. Look what you bought. Look at your holla at your boy. Holla at your boy. Holla at your boy. Chicken. Oh, chicken and waffle. Holla at your boy. Yeah. Holla at your boy. Okay. Don't play with me. All right now. Okay, so am I ready to play? You ready for me to play? Okay. Let's go. I got my, I got my, look, it's brown like this because of the hot sauce, not because she burned up. Oh, oh yeah, come on. Mozzarella, I know. It. Mozzarella sauce on this chicken. Yeah. <laughs> do it. Yes, he will if you met him. And, <laughs> oh, and then Thank I'm going to Salad. Did I put just a little lemon juice, salt, and pepper, and olive oil? That's right. Oh, look at that. Oh. I know you here for that. And look at that party people. And this is my hot chicken bruschetta. Oh. Mozzarella truffle sauce. Yes, that's what she made in this season. That's right. So we're gonna we're gonna be doing uh, more cooking. And uh, one more time, let everybody know how you can be reached. Well, check me out on, first of all, the Catch a Kitchen Petition. I'm so excited about 
uh, to catch a beautician on VH1, May 25th. I'm so excited about that. And also, all handles. Period. There, there it is. There it is. I'm just no, I'm telling y'all right now. Hey, I love you too. Uh, don't look. Follow me on Instagram at official Ricky Smiley. Don't go to my RS comedy because it's real ratchet. Do not go to the RS comedy Instagram. Don't do it. It's real, real ratchet. Okay. Just go to Ricky Smiley official. And uh, hey, I want to thank uh, everybody, James, Stephen Brown, everybody that allowed us this wonderful opportunity. And uh, so for more recipes, uh, just make sure you watch them again and uh, go to uh, foxsoul.tv, foxsoul.tv, and you can uh, download it and you can follow uh, follow us on YouTube. Man, I think I'm going to take a bite. Are you eating? I'm about to take a bite. Hey, cheers. Cheers. Look at that. Ding. Look at that. Cheers. Cheers. Mm, mm, mm. Oh. You hear that crunch? You hear that crunch? Mm. mm, mm. mm. Mine got oh, mm. Man, I heard that. <laughs> and the lemon, oh my God. I forgot to make the sunrise. I was getting ready to make the sunrise, the orange juice and the lemonade mixed up, the whole LA sunrise thing. What happened, bro? I forgot. <laughs> 